As you know, on the 22nd of February, the NEB said this program can go ahead, providing that you fulfill 156 conditions, and they added 16 recommendations. So we're working on that part of it. But also, uh, equally importantly, the Federal Court of Appeal told us there were two things that, and, and that's what brought things to a stop, uh, that had to be done properly. One is more consultation, meaningful consultation, and the other thing is looking at the marine safety side of things as opposed to just what happens when it's the pipeline is, is over land. So what happens when all that uh, dill bit gets into the tankers and is on its way out through the Salish Sea to the high seas. So we had already started on that with the Oceans Protection Plan and uh, of course we're continuing with that. So those are major efforts and that's the reason for the extension uh, we felt, or Minister Sohi who leads this because he's the Minister of Natural Resources, felt that uh, there's over 100 First Nations to consult uh, and uh, there's, I believe it's eight teams that are out there and they've been working non-stop for months and we felt that we needed a few more weeks and so but we're optimistic that on the 18th we will be in a position to make a decision.